today's in this weekend's reading vlog and in general week of my life i'm gonna tell you this is actually first video of mine like a whole week in my life i've never done it before so i'm quite excited mainly reading reading book shopping and all that good stuff and for today i also want to read <laughs> also i have to sell some of my books because i'm actually selling my books and i would love to show them to you if you want to buy a book because the thing is that most of my books i try to sell when i finish them because i just want people to have the reading experience and i don't want books to you know just sit alone um, on my shelf if i know that i'm not gonna pick them up again so this is my store i think you can call it like that we're gonna do that now we're gonna take some pictures of the book of the books and then actually we're gonna go for a walk and we're gonna read i'm gonna show you what i'm currently reading I'm reading Sybil's Secret, is a companion novel to Wild Wood Dancing, which is my favorite book ever. Like this is my favorite book. Next to Bees. Those those are my two books, my two favorite books. And I started reading that yesterday and I'm so in love. We follow here um this girl, her name is Paula, and she and her father go to this journey to Istanbul to do some uh business because they're searching for this magical artifact and they want to trade it. I think they want to buy it, I'm not quite sure yet but um, they're going to Istanbul and and that's what I know so far I really like the vibe of it it's very like exotic and just different to see see the culture of, of Istanbul and it's all it's gonna be also magical and, and so I'm very excited about this and um, okay let's do some pictures and then we're gonna post them so this is actually my whole huge shelf of books that I will be selling and as you can see there's quite a lot of English books right here too we have like Hobbit and Enchanted and Enchantment of Ravens Pumpkin Queen I, I love all of these books but I know I'm not gonna pick them up soon or maybe ever this book is so good I read it when I was a child and it was so good Let's take some pictures. See you later, alligator. Okay guys, so I did all the pictures for the bottom shelf. I want to reread Twilight in English. That's, that's why I'm selling the Polish version. This is my favorite book ever and I was thinking about keeping it, but I want people to read it because this is my favorite book ever. This and Wildwood Dancing, those are, my, those are my two favorite books. And I want to read this one in English too. And I love this copy, but I feel like that I love it so much and I feel that people should read this book. I have Pretty Little Liars here. Here basically I have like a fantasy. I have some Stephen King, If I Had Your Face. That was very, very good book, but I'm not gonna read it. It was very sad, very good, but uh, if someone wants to read it, I'm just gonna give that to someone. We Were Liars, also enjoyed it, also selling. It Ends With Us, I did a reading vlog on that. I, it, it was a interesting one. I know that I don't want to read anything by Colin Hoover again, but it was a interesting um, discovery. The girl who circumnavigated Fairyland in a ship of her own making. That was really cute, very sweet book, but I'm not going to read that, so it goes. Ooh, we have Clara and the Sun. This is one of the greatest books I've ever read. It was beautiful, amazing, it was touching, it was so smart. Very important book, so take it from me. There you go, <laughs> take it. Yeah, I have some classics too. I have Watering Heights. That's like a nice beginning for me because in the future I would like to have my own bookshop. So let's take more pictures of these. Smile. You look beautiful. <laughs> Yay guys, we did it. And now we're gonna go for the walk. Look how cute socks I have. I, I just have to show it to you. It's Calcifer. Guys, it's Calcifer from House Moving Castle.
fact that I'm in the same hoodie as I was yesterday. Today we have a Tuesday. It's a very windy and very rainy Tuesday. I wanted to go for a walk with a book today and we will. We actually will go. I love the smell of earth after after raining so do we have some plans for today work, work and read and learn and teach you know teach my students english okay maybe actually let's write my to-do list i also want to post more books on my shop because though i even though i did take pictures of all the books i'm selling i still didn't post uh all of them i posted like half of it so for today i so i would like to post more books i need to edit two videos i need to do a thing connected to my poetry collection because i'm publishing my poetry collection soon in polish so then write a synopsis for my novel and of course read yesterday we were talking about this book which i'm I, i'm so in love with this book right now they are so basically paula and her father are in istanbul already and because of politics and how things with women look like there you know it's very dangerous to be a woman in that times in Istanbul they cannot do any business not many of them can like you know show their faces properly um, so it's very dangerous to be a woman basically so because of that father hires a, um, a guide not a guide a guardian a guardian for Paula uh, there's no relationship yet he's just a good-looking quiet guy but of course there's gonna be something going on come on uh, and I'm excited to see how it's gonna be developed and so far they're just talking about this Sybil's artifact this magic artifact we don't know much yet but i'm so excited to like see what's the core of it and we're also going to read today the use of enchantment which i was talking about in different of my videos which is speaks about the importance of fairy tales in people's life mainly about children's life and how it is important for a child to have fairy tales in their life in order to develop properly and i think it's so beautiful it talks a lot about psychology psychoanalysis dreams too it's very it's very it's not like too complicated but it's very complex and i feel like it can help people who kind of deals with personal issues and it, because it's not a self-help book but it's gonna help you to become more self-aware i feel like and read some fairy tales honestly because they do you some good <laughs> So I just had my Italian classes. Also, two books came and I'm going to uh, open them next week because I will be recording book haul. I'm taking my book with me. I'm taking the key to this garden place when I can go. <laughs> So it is raining a little bit, just a little bit. I still managed to read. Of course, I don't want my book to get wet, but the rain is like so delicate, it doesn't even touch it, you know? And I love the smell of the ground through the rain. I just wish I could live inside the woods. bird watching <laughs> I just saw a bird looking for sticks for its helm so I just came back from the trip we have a second love interest I mean I, I don't know if that's the second one because I don't know if the guard is a love interest but come on 
of course he will be but now we also have the second male character and he's a pirate he's a trader that she actually bumped into when they were sailing at the beginning of the book but like they didn't had a meeting or anything but he did steal her scarf i mean she lost it and he took it doesn't matter and now he found her because of i don't know we, we don't know much yet but basically they met so that that's so cool it's wednesday i just woke up and today we're gonna i don't know yet what i have few things to do but this sun is beautiful the weather is beautiful and i'm and i'm sure we're gonna do things connected to nature and flowers and books so let's go <laughs> So today we actually have a quite a lot of things to do because I didn't manage to do everything yesterday. So of course we have to learn Italian, Vietnamese, post some more books on my shop and a lot of writing because I have a writing day today. So I need to create a book cover for my poetry collection that I'm publishing this month. But this publishing house that I've been working with, it's not cooperating. It's very hard to, to like contact them and but whatever. I will be working on a cover right now um, and I need to check two books that I will be publishing on Amazon. One is book for children and the other one is a poetry collection. So these two I need to check. Oh, the sun came. I need to write a synopsis for my other children's book. Those are the most important things. I have written a few more, but let's do them first. Oh, and I need to replant plants. Like I need to put them, because I bad plants yesterday and I need to put them in those. How are they called? You know what I mean. And now we're gonna do a little bit of journaling. Okay guys, so it's been very very busy. It's like a very busy and a little bit stressful morning. It's not stressful, but it's a bit busy because I want to do as much as I can because day is short and now I'm doing my book cover and I think when you're gonna see this video my book will be already out um, so you can buy it if you read Polish poetry, <laughs> but probably not. And I'm thinking about two fonts. Fonts? Fonts? I will show it to you. That's the first one. And that's the second one. Um, I will ask my mom and my sister, but I also, I think I prefer the first one more, but we will see. Hi guys, I thought I'm gonna... I'm gonna update you a little bit to my productive morning. I've been editing all day. I've been editing all day. I also tried to contact publisher, which was impossible because they don't respond phone calls. And then I wrote an email. Then they actually responded for an email. The thing is that they just have to send it to print and they don't give me any additional information. Like, I don't know what is going on. They're just being silent. And when I tell them that I I'm calling, but no one is responding, they're like, bullshit. I mean, they didn't write bullshit, but they wrote like a, um, like nonsense kind of thing. In English, it'll be nonsense. Nonsense. We are responding and I'm like No, because I called you and it's just very stressful because I want to be done with it I want to stop working with them. I'm gonna I can't stop working with them But I just want to finish this project so I can move on but I decided on the first cover So that's that let's just hope they're gonna print it soon because I don't know what's stopping them because they have everything I'm sorry for I'm sorry about this rumbling. I know you don't need it, but Apart from that, I've been editing, working on a cover, and I'm so tired and like emotionally drawn that I have to take a walk because I can't sit on my in my desk in front of my computer. I'm just gonna take the book with me and we're just gonna walk. The water, the weather is also not perfect, but we're gonna work with what we have. So as you can see, I just came back. I just came back from my trip. Not gonna lie, I feel 100 times better. Gosh, books are literally therapy. Like you don't need much, just read a book. 
and go for a walk in nature. The girls are in the bathing 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 house right now. There's something so beautiful and magical about those bathing house from the past, you know, like the Greek, uh, Turkish one. It's just it's filled with such a vibe. And they're in a um, woman bathing house, of course. And I just like the idea of femininity and being a woman, being so open. I love it. I love it so much. And I like the woman that the protagonist is there with. I'm feeling, I don't think there's gonna be anything between them, but I like the tension between them. I would love to read some sapphic books, honestly, because when I just read how protagonist describes, you know, her body and the beauty of like, you know, um, her curves and her skin, it's just like, yes, yes, women, yes. So I I'm not gonna lie, I would like to, I would like to see a spark between them, but I think the spark is gonna be between two male two males unfortunately i mean it's still cool because i think the dudes are cool but it would be nice to have a little bit of the next day Yes, you guessed it. We are going for a walk. Let's go. Join me. Do you want to join me? Join me. I'm so tired. I'm so tired and I had only two lessons and I have two more. I love conducting classes, but I guess it's something, there's something very tiring and the fact that you have to be very focused on one person only, it's just like you need to keep your constant attention and it's just tiring a little bit. But I'm of course very happy and very grateful to have my students. So I had two so far and I will have two more today and I don't think I will have time to replant plants because of that or maybe i will we will see but it's around 5 p.m and i want to go to sleep I have a class literally in like seven minutes. I need to put myself together. I'm gonna learn with Max and we're gonna learn grammar. Let's go. Hi guys, so as you can see, we're in my bathroom and we're going to plant some plants. But So we are in my bathroom, in my bathtub, and I'm gonna get into the bath bathtub. I wanted to do that on my balcony, but for my defense, it's too cold. And I'm not gonna do that on my balcony. So we have four plants, as you could see, and we're just gonna put them into the... Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done, guys. Flowers are done. 
Should I give them names? I don't know. But what I will do is put those tiny little decorations on, on them, which is this hat. I'm just gonna put him here because I think he looks cute. I also have this little guy. He's from House Moving Castle. And I have Totoro. I also have him. My boyfriend made him for me. Look how cute. Good. Good work, guys. Good work. <laughs> Today we have a Friday and I think it's gonna be the last day of the reading vlog because I don't think I'm gonna record anything on the weekend. I'm a Quidditch player by the way. I think for today we honestly have very similar plans. We're gonna go for a walkie with the book. The sun is shining, I don't know what's gonna happen later. So today I have a plan to record two videos and edit two other ones. Bánh mì I think my packages just arrived. I think the postman left it outside the door. That's cool because I was actually about to make myself matcha because I ran out of coffee. But actually, my coffee came. Oh, I also bought some tea. It's a uh, yerba mate and it's orange flavor. And my green cup. The sun is still up, which I'm so excited about because we're gonna go for a walk. I was afraid it's gonna be very gloomy and sad. It's very beautiful, so we're gonna go for a walk. I am wearing a this. I'm wearing this because I still don't know how many degrees. I don't know, honestly, I think it's quite warm, but that's gonna be like my problem. And we're taking a book with us. Let's go, shall we? Okay guys, it is very sunny, but uh, but it is actually quite cold. And it's, it's not like super cold, but it's like fresh, you know? So good I took a... So, but it's so nice! I can't, I'm so happy where the sun is out. I know I keep saying it every time when we go for a walk, but... Okay guys, we've been editing for a while. I've been editing my sim and I've been also trying to do thumbnail for a video that is coming up this Monday. So it's already on. I'm wondering which thumb thumbnail did I choose. Because I'm thinking about three and I will show you. It's this one. There's also this and also this. I think I like this one the most because I'm smiling, but I don't know. So guys. I'm drinking my matcha and I guess I just wanted to properly tell you goodbye <laughs> because Friday is finishing this is gonna be evening soon and then night and then end of the week it's hard to tell yet anything about it because honestly I'm just like not even in the middle but I really love it that's what I can tell you and it's not a surprise because I loved the other book written by this author so um, I'm just gonna keep on reading that and you will see my summary of this book probably in like a wrap-up video but it was very fun I hope you had fun watching me I love watching reading vlog so we will see maybe it's gonna be another series of mine and I just love connected to nature and do all that stuff so if you find it cool to see then I can do that. Thank you so, so much for watching and I just wish you to stay happy, positive, sambu, keep on connecting to nature and do your thing, you know? Just find a goal and keep on working on it. 
So thank you so much for watching. Bye.